Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Chrono Cross. So today we're going to be finishing up that last little wing right there and then heading into where Lynx should be. So let's go ahead and get started. So far the three rooms, one of them was just a puzzle and two of them had bosses. I don't specifically remember. I know what this room looks like and kind of how the puzzle works. I don't remember if there was a boss though. So that's going to be something we're going to have to figure out together. But this is kind of like a drop down type puzzle. Let's see. Watch Keeper faces north as we defend the fort. Let's go west. Yeah, let's see what west does. So basically we have to, one of them is the one we have to go to. The other two just gives us like loot and stuff. It'd be cool. Okay. Uh, okay, my controller. Please controller, work with me here. So we got two chests. Okay, my controller once again is not working, so that's great. Come on. Alright, there we go. Got it fixed. Volcano. I don't know who uses Volcano, but once Flame Charm, that's going to be helping us for fire. So this is a lot of good loot. Magma Burst. So we won't need to come back here. And Fire Pillar. Alright, so it's all good loot. We don't really need it. We didn't, like, need any of it. You know what? That's fine. The more the merrier, that's for sure. Let's go ahead and climb up. Um, boom. And let's see what's going on. And I guess we'll try... North. Oh, wait. Why don't we just go north? The Watchkeeper faces north as we defend the fort. Uh, let's go... Let's go west. That should take me to either the... S yeah, it'd take me right... This is where I wanted to go. This is where I wanted to go, so... That's good. I think this is right... Yeah, this is... Yeah, this, this is where I was supposed to go. Let's see, is there a boss with this one? Doesn't look like there's a boss. Okay, so maybe there's just two puzzles and two bosses. And I'm definitely okay with that. Alright. So, now we got the little elevator to go up. And I'm pretty sure, if you guys go back to episode 1, and we start off in an elevator scene. And I told you guys on episode that that is basically like we're starting out in the middle of the game. We do a little chunk of it, and then we come back to that part of the game later. Well, this is actually that part of the game. So now, w me, kid, and last time we had Razly, but this time we're going to have Greco. We're going to do the exact same thing. Literally the exact same thing over again. But then this time, once we get past that part, we're actually going to keep continuing the game instead of obviously going back to when Kid or when Serge was still in his bed. So before we leave, let's 100% sure make sure we save because there will be bosses up ahead. I mean, there's bosses everywhere in this game, so there's no doubt that there will be some bosses up ahead. Let's open it up. Yes! Ah, oh, this boss. I hate this boss. Uh, this is a fairly easy one, but man, I remember this one being very, very annoying because he can change his stats and stuff. You guys will see. And it's, and it's and I can't really hit it with physical attacks, which is also kind of annoying. And the thing also does hit pretty hard. Uh, it's white. We don't want to hit it with Luminaire then. But we can hit it with everything else. Luckily, we don't have too many white spells on us, actually, so... And you can see the gold earring is giving Kid about 15 more HP. Which actually isn't too much. But, you know what? It's something. And especially with her dire need of health. I think she, need she needs it. Oh god, this spell is so annoying. And that hurts so much. And then it changes its mood. Now it's sad. Oh, what is it doing? Okay. I was like, I didn't tell him to do that. Let's hit it with the two. 
Now let's hit it with that magma burst real quick. But real quick, I'm also gonna make sure my controller's working here. Bam. What? I had it for like literally nothing. Let's use red pin on it. I don't think this will do much. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if this is magic or physical attack. Okay, that's, that's good. Weak minded. I'm pretty sure this just lowers defense. Mag lowers magic defense. Strong minded. Oh, and he's gonna. He's gonna buff his own defense, right? Alright, what is he changing to? Happy. That means he's gonna go kissing again, right? That's not good. Um, let's just use a magma bomb. Let's see how much damage this will do to him. If it doesn't do much, I'm not going to do it again. Zero. Definitely not going to be hitting that guy again. Boom. Okay, he's finally woken up. Surge is woken up. Let's hit it with the arrow blaster. Hopefully this does a bit of damage. Man. I don't know. Maybe I'm maybe I'm doing this fight wrong. I don't know how to. Apparently, I don't know how to hit him. Is Greco's magic just not high, or is this thing immune? It looks like the thing was just Greco's magic is just not high. The thing is getting low though. That's actually fine. Oh, and it missed. Look at you. Mode change. All right, what are you gonna change to? To I don't even know. Is that sad? I don't even know. That's fine though. Let's try to go for the three. Ah, bad idea. Go back to kid. Hit it with two. And then why not electro bolt? Let's just try out electro bolt. Hopefully this will hit for at least 30, 40. Okay, 30, that's good. Anti-black. So we can't use dark magic, which we didn't have much anyway. That's completely fine. I don't want to hit it with meteorite, because it's also black. Let's just go with Surge then, and just go straight up to its face. And miss. Let's hit it with an Aqua Ball. We've got really nothing else to do, we just have to chip at it slowly. This thing's clearly not going to kill us anytime soon, unless it brings out some huge AoE attack that I don't know about yet, which it hasn't shown off yet. Holy- aw, oh, this must be it. This is going to hurt. Aw, oh, that didn't hurt that bad. What? What a weak boss. I thought that thing was going to do at least 200 damage to everybody. Just heal all. That'll, this will basically just revert everything she just did, or he. I don't know, it's a weird sun-looking thing. I don't know what gender it is, but... Is that it? Was it below 5 health? Seriously, it was below 5 health. Well, that thing is clearly in a lot of pain. Dude, that thing is literally stuff of nightmares. I don't even know what that is. That is a... I don't know if that's a living thing or if that's like a machine, but that is a creepy machine slash living face thing. Clock. Looks like a clock, like a sun clock. Alright, well that was a boss fight, so we did get a star. And we found some iron, look at that. Let's go ahead and turn this boy off. And this will be another one of those things up in that circle room that we've been seeing last episode. This thingy, with all the dragon things. So. I think we have one more boss to light up the last pyre thingy. Alright, and we got an, um, an elevator. Now, this elevator, we can go either up or down. First, the way we're supposed to go is up, so we're gonna go down first. Uh, I think there's something down here we can kind of collect. I think there's an, it's some kind of device not functioning. Okay, we gotta actually bring an egg down here. That's what I remember. We gotta we gotta get some sort of egg and bring it here, which we don't have it with us yet. We might have to grab it from another world and bring it back. I think if we bring the right egg, we'll be able to 
get another character, which is like a little mini dragon thing. But I, that, I think that's what I remember. Don't I won't take that as a fact. But here we are. If you guys remember the first scene in the game, this is literally the exact scene right here. We got out the elevator. And yeah, we're basically at the start of the game once again. See? So yeah, and there is the last boss. I'm pretty sure we have to go fight that thing. Now, I don't think I have a save point, so I better not lose to that last boss. That would suck. Quite a bit. Oh, and there's a soldier. There's soldiers here. Okay, so I don't... Can I heal myself so I can grab that capsule? No, oh, everyone's full health. Alright, whatever. Follow me. Okay, we're just gonna juke him out. I don't really feel like fighting him. So, I'm just gonna juke him out. And we'll move on. Cause I think we're gonna be strong enough. The past couple fights have been fairly easy. Although, I don't think I can juke this guy. Yeah, this guy will have to fight. Because, yeah, his, like body is so big I won't be able to kind of juke him out like I did with that soldier but it's fine this guy isn't that strong we beat one of them last episode if we're even able to hit it you know I won't do anything with him because I want to use luminaire good hits and I want to use red pin I really wish we had luminaire and red pin when we were fighting the dwarves that would have absolutely demolished them yeah this thing doesn't even hit that hard over to surge hopefully he hits that all right now we can luminaire there we go easy peasy let me make sure my controllers doing this thing yeah luminaire and red pin right now are our biggest like attacks and it's really good that they're also aoe so if we face a boss next that's like somehow it's kind of like gimmick is reproducing we'll be able to kill a lot of its little spawns with those types of attacks i don't think we will i know the dwarves had that kind of gimmick where there was so many of them oh okay uh another thing if we're below that ledge the bat can't actually get to us which is interesting oh it's a thingy That's our last boss. Let's go ahead and clean it up. I'm really hoping we, hoping we don't die because then we might have to redo that sun boss. And of course I'll do that off camera, but that would be quite annoying. Okay, this thing is susceptible to normal attacks, which is good. And it's red, so we can use Luminaire, which is also good. Hopefully we can disperse of this boss fairly quickly. Although I don't think it was made to be a hard boss either because since we've had two bosses with no save point, I'm sure the game wouldn't hate us that much to make it a really hard one without a save point all right magma bomb that's not gonna do much it'll do about 50 to all of us not even what only like 20 weak let's go ahead and use arrow blaster on the thing <clears throat> now his attack damage magic dam oh okay that did more than i thought it would do i'm pleasantly surprised Alright, now comes the real boss. I tricked you. You, th you thought the frog was a real boss? No way, Jose. It's actually this thingamajigger. This eyeball thingy. But luckily, that the eye eyeball itself, it has some really good AoE attacks. But they're actually not that strong. And he's still susceptible to everything. And now he's dark. So, we have Photon. Oh, I took Photon right off, didn't I? That's annoying, that's fine. Let's use Ice Blaster. <clears throat> Although I wonder, is this guy susceptible to magic? Yeah, okay, so we can hit him with pretty much anything and he'll get hurt. <clears throat> Let's see, how much does he do? Oh, 54 is pretty good, actually. But we'll just use Red Pin. We haven't used Red Pin yet, so this should do quite a bit of damage. Bam! 150 easy and we're I might use a heal all here um you know I'm not gonna use a heal all 
but I will heal Surge because I don't know if this guy could bring out some big AoE like laser attack. I think he has. And I don't want that to kill Surge instantly. Okay, we missed. I'm gonna go ahead and defend, defend. Gravitone. Okay, so this is an AoE. No, it's not an AoE attack. But that is effective against him. Actually, we'll just go to Surge over here. Hit him with the two. Hit him with another one. And, you know what? I won't heal all. I don't think I'm in that dire need. Although, I might get a uh, kid to tier plus. Hit him two. And I'm thinking... Let's get a cure plus on Surge. Just in case, because we also have to remember, Surge is the only one with revive. So if he dies, we're doing this solo. Which isn't fun. Free fall. This is a pretty strong attack, if I remember correctly. Yeah, that is, that is quite an attack. So... I'm just gonna do a cure plus. No reason to use a heal all because none of us, not all of us, are in dire need. So I'm gonna go ahead and just use a cure plus, which doesn't cure that much actually. Okay, come on. And you know what? I'm just gonna go to kid. Maybe try to get a spell ready. That did a good bit of damage. You know what? Maybe I can... Nah, actually I won't need to. Let's go ahead and place a cure on Greco. Just in case. If he has something that does over 200 damage, he's gonna be in a bad zone. So if we get him up to 200, he'll be fine. Devil Thun- Okay. This is what I was talking about. His laser attack. Yes, I remember this attack. Except I thought it did a lot more than that. Right, let's go to Greco. And let's hope he hits the shots here because I needed to use a heal all. Yeah, heal all. That's the attack that I was actually looking for, but I thought it would be a lot stronger than that. I guess not. Oh, that wasn't as much healing as I thought. Let's use another heal all then. Actually, I don't even need to use that, but you know what? Whatever. This boss should be dead. Oh, yeah, I probably shouldn't use that, but this boss is probably almost close to being dead if I could just hit my stupid abilities let's use dash and slash I don't know if this will hurt him more because he's dark but it'll definitely hit him a little bit defend okay Greco has really good defense so that's not gonna even phase him gravity blow okay this will hurt a little bit I think I'm definitely gonna have to heal her. No, I won't even. Oh, that was a garbage attack. That is completely fine. What? Okay, well, it looks like it's on the ropes here. So we're gonna go ahead and go straight for the throat. If anybody can hit their shots, at least. Now, you know what? Let's just go straight to Surge. Because he's a high attacker. Bro, come on. Okay. Well, this is gonna hurt, but not that badly, so that's fine. It hit Surge quite big. Um, come on, don't hit, don't miss. Good hit. And hopefully, I, I'm having hopes that this takes us out. I don't think so. I don't think it will though. Yeah, it's got just a tiny bit more health. Not too much. This should kill him. Yeah, I, I, I knew that third hit would kill him. Boom. Alright, good fight, good fight. That was actually a really easy fight, so I'm very happy with that. Let's use consumables, make sure we heal ourselves. I do not think there is another fight, but just in case, it's always better to be safe than sorry. Alright, and that should be the last little dragon statue. Now it is time to make our way up. 
It's time to make our way up. And then, spoilers, we are gonna see Lynx there. Oh no! I didn't want to fight him. Ah, that sucks. The, the, honestly, the thing is, I would fight these, but since I'm recording videos, like, I'm trying to get through this, like, fairly quickly. So I could get, like, at least two boss fights in one episode, or, you know, two large plot lines in an episode. Things like this, they just... They slow me down, man. They slow me down. It's uber annoying. And again, I would be fighting them normally, because I need for levels. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, and we missed the chest up there. Oh, we missed the chest down there. No! Actually, no, that was the capsule, right? Uh, that was the capsule, and I do not want to grab that capsule, because I can't. I'm already full. Hey, guys, if you remember this scene, we are back. Actually, I'm just going to move forward. Alright. Now, sit back, relax, and watch the show. Come on, mate. Well, this is gonna end badly. It's all I'm saying. It's gonna end badly. There is General Viper, Lynx, and the Frozen Flame. Finally, we've been expecting you. Oh, thank you. Do we have like tea? I have nothing personal against you, but anyone who hinders our plan must be eliminated. I'm rather sorry about that. Um. We're fighting General Viper? No problemo. Let's fight him. He should be pretty easy. Care for some warming up first? Yeah, then now come on, I'll take you on. Dude, we're gonna beat the crap out of him. He's like a million years old. Okay, he does a good amount of damage, but he's still old. What color is he? He's yellow? Alright, well, Luminaire is fine. As long as he's not white. It's all good. Bang. Should do about 150. Okay, that was a little high. Only 100. Flip flop. Hey, a new thing. Do a jazz leap to spinning drop kick. This is a new tech. I like it. This is, he's literally a Mexican wrestler. He's like Rey Mysterio, but fatter. Alright, good hits. G-Force. <laughs> Alright. Bringing some science into this. 68. Not too strong. No problemo. Hit him with some good attack. Let's go back to Kid. Can she... Okay, she can use Red Pin. Good stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and defend with him. Then attack with Greco. He's clearly on his last. Oh no, he dodged it. Okay, what's well, a little damage? I think Kid will be able to finish him off right here. If she hits her attacks, nice. And then you know what? I'll just go to Surge, and this should finish him off. Nice. Ha ha ha. Well, we really we got. Uh, fairly lucky at the end there. We hit a lot of our shots right away. Little level up. Let's make sure to heal because in Chrono Cross fashion, we will have another fight. You are a worthy opponent, but let us see how you do now. I should give it to you my all. Lynx. You traitor. Boy! Why would you trust Lynx? Since when was that a good idea? I'm gonna rant about it. Since when was that a good idea? Since when? You were extremely useful in helping me make my way around these islands. I appreciate your help, General. However, I no longer have any need for you. This fort shall serve as a fine grave marker for you and your dragoons. May you rest in peace. Forgive me, Riddle. It, look what you did, guy. Riddle told you not to work with them. You're like, nah, fam. I'm gonna do it anyway. Look what happened. 
I'll let this be your final resting place as well. Come on, Lynx, you're going down. Time to fight your boy! Let's do this. But man, General Viper, like, I don't like that guy, man. He's dumb. I mean, I don't know what Lynx told him, but he's dumb. Nice, two good hits. Let's hit him with Luminaire. This should do quite a bit of damage, because I think Lynx is black. I didn't look, but I just kind of guessed. 135, okay, that's pretty good. Let's go over to Kid. Hit him. Ooh, good hits. Glide Hook. Wham. Nah, it's not even that strong. Let's use Red Pin. Put up, put up. Do about a hundred. Good stuff. Go to Greco. Bam, bam. Let's use flip flop. I don't think this does a lot of damage, but you know what? I like I like the animation, so you know what? Give him a good booping in the face. And the thing about Lynx, he does attack very often though. Like when he attacks, he attacks pretty good. Let's use. Um, uh, you know what, let's just go to Kid. I would use a heal all, but I don't think we need it just yet. Okay, he's getting low already, Graviton. Okay, he'll hit Surge, but Surge, oh, he hits everybody. I think everyone can heat, handle it, but now we're definitely going to be using a heal all. That's definitely going to be a thing we're going to have to do. Right, let's go back to Surge. Nice! It, oh, that last shot was brutal. Alright. Ooh. Ooh. Those are some attacks right there. I tell ya. Let's use Ice Blast. I would heal, but I don't think we need to heal, actually. Pretty sure we could take one, one more attack from him. And he's dead right there anyway, so... Oh, although he's not dead. But... The fight is over. Now, this part will make a lot of you very angry. A lot of you will get very angry here. But this has to happen. You're more trouble than I thought. Do you really think your skills are more superior than mine? Sore loser. Serge, have you ever questioned who you really are? <clears throat> Serge? What has been the significance of your existence up until now? That ominous day ten years ago, the boundary of space and time was torn, and part of me, in fact, died. So hey, you remember that uh, Jaguar we've been seeing that we kept seeing attack? Yeah, that thing was attacking Surge. Also, that was Lynx. Surprise, surprise. You cannot defeat me, Surge. This is because denying me is the same as erasing your very existence. Don't be taken in by this rubbish, Surge. This guy is full of it. Hmm. We'll see about that. There are two sides of every coin. Life and death, love and hate. They are all the same. What do you say? Talk some sense, will ya? This is, this is the part where a lot of you will probably get, like, pretty angry. I guess who? He took over my body. Surge, what's wrong? Lynx, what have you done to Surge? Surge, you alright? Mm, yes, I'm fine. I'm just fine, kid. He's really not. Oh, jeez.
What are you doing, Lynx? Now's your chance, kid. I'll kill him. Yeah, I know. This is the end of you, Lynx. Say your prayers. Yeah. Well, we're now Lynx. So, yeah, obviously this fight we're not supposed to win. We're not going to win this fight. Win against three of them. Uh, but we're just gonna have to pretty much live it out. Let's see. I wonder what spells we have. Yeah, it's also kind of unfair that we only have 300 health. Uh, do we have like the same? Did we did we keep the same? Oh, we kept the same moves, like the same table. Let's just defend. Obviously, once again, we're not supposed to be winning, but. I kind of want to see special abilities. Let's do that, and then... Pretty sure we have the kitty attack, right? No, dash and slash, that's dark. Hit it one more time. Feral cats, yeah. I kind of want to show you guys this move. This move is kind of kind of cool. So it's just a bunch of, like, demon cats. It's kind of cool. Bam. But yeah, sadly, we will get taken down. There is no way we can actually win that fight. Bum, bum, bum. Na, 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 na. You did it, kid. Yeah. Now finish him. What's wrong? Settle it once and for all. Here, hand me your dagger. I'll finish him off. You've made a mistake. Watch this, kid. I'll avenge Luke before you die, Lynx. Wait. Okay. Spoiler. Kind of, not really. How does Surge know who Luca is? We've never played, or we've never seen a Luca with Surge, and Luca is actually, um, kid's adoptive mother, I think? So she finally realizes that. Here's your foe, isn't he? How do you know Luca's name? What are you talking about, kid? Not once did I ever mention Luca's name to you, Serge. No, don't tell me your Yeah, um... Yeah. And uh, a, a, a little stabby stab, you know what I mean? Yeah, that sucks. And, uh, the vision that we've been seeing for basically the entire game has come true. Surprise, surprise. So... He's got my body. Quiet. This is the end of the road for you, kid. Ugh, your links ain't ya. Hee hee hee. I'll send I'll send you to see Luca. I'll finish you off later. Look at yourself, Surge. I mean, Lynx, he he, excellent. The enemy is growing. The only thing pure in the world is the enemy. Ah, uh, well then, the time has come for curtain fall. Your service are no longer needed. Even your very existence is worthless. Farewell, Surge. And he grabbed the frozen flame. Finally, I have the key, the key to the gate of fate. So y'all have to remember, uh, throughout all this, remember, the only one that could go between worlds and do special stuff was Surge. The Frozen Flame has the ability to make people switch bodies. So why do you think Lynx was so interested in Surge's body? Well, because again, it's the only one that can do things. So Lynx, this was his plan all along to steal Surge's body. So then he could kind of run the world because essentially right now he is Surge. Surge is like the big thing. He's the one that made all of this possible. If he has Surge's body, he can basically do whatever he wants. 
Finally, I have the key. So the key is basically the frozen flame, but it's also the body. Surge himself. Uh, the time has finally come for the frozen flame to awaken. Come to the Sea of Eden, Surge, should you wish to end your dream of ten years ago. Now, let love bleed darker and deeper than the seas of hell. Ha 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 ha. Now we get sent to a mystical land. And this is probably also the ugliest part of the game, graphically, because they did not do a very good job with this place. But you know what? We can get through it because we are good at this game. Also, all these things that I'm telling you could be wrong. Maybe I'm hallucinating. Or I'm delusional. I don't know. If you want to read the story, look it up on Wiki. Ugh. This place is gross. I know it's supposed to be like this because this is like dream, heaven, hell thingy. But man, it looks like a child drew it. And literally, that's the, uh, it's what it's supposed to be. Hello? Okay, I can't talk to that. I guess let's go save and then we will end up the episode here. Can I go, can I go save? I can't. Uh, okay. Wait a minute. I know what, whatever. You know what, we'll end it off here, guys. Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment, add support to the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.